welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if this is your first time so today is my last video in my set of favorites this year and i am finishing it off with the stylers and gels i literally don't do any styles pretty much without some type of styler or gel wash and goes even twist outs um buns all that kind of stuff I'm using some sort of styler or gel. It just works well for my hair. So let's hop right into them. The first gel that I'm gonna be telling you guys about is oldie but goodie. And that's the Eco Styler. And this is the Argan Oil Gel. I have this little bottle because, I don't know, I couldn't find the, uh, the, like, the big one. They didn't have it in Target, I think. But this is my has become my go-to for wash and goes. It used to be another one, but I think I like how this one's been working better. I don't, yeah, it, I just prefer it right now for wash and go styles. It uh, has a max hold of 10. Most of the gels that I'm gonna talk about today are max hold, get your hair crunchy type gels just because that's what I use. It helps my wash and goes last. I see, I get longevity out of my styles. So this is one of those, I may have a decent crunch day one, but it'll scrunch the crunch and over time, it just holds. Um, I prefer this one, I don't know why. I think it's the argan oil, but I prefer this one over the olive oil, over the clear one. Um, I think those are the only two that I've used of Eco, but, oh, and the black flaxseed one. This is my favorite go-to. I just like the hold on this one um, the most. The second gel is the gel I was referring to um, before, which is the Extreme, it's now Extreme. It's got wet line still on the top. It used to be wet line extreme or is wet line extreme. That's what we're gonna call it. This is this big old, tub of gel for literally three dollars um it's everywhere now target beauty supply store i love this this is also an extreme control 10 times hold gel i do still use it for wash and goes uh, but they changed this formula and even though it has a green lid it's still the formula of the blue lid sidebar i got so excited because i saw this one and i thought oh green lid they went back to the original whatever they used to do with wet line before they changed it no it's just literally a packaging change and it's the same formula as the blue lid if you have no idea what i'm talking about then that means you need to try wet line extreme but if you know you know okay so uh still love this gel three dollars for all of this this is normally slick back um buns now um or maybe even a twist out uh i still use this for wash and goes depending on what i'm pairing it with but this is kind of has no smell it's like a mm, well it has a little bit of a smell but just uh, all around good can do anything uh, type gel. So the third product is more of a styler and this is the main choice pearly braid out glaze from their tropical moringa line. Uh, this is one of those slimy uh, products that just kind of ooey gooey falls through there. Um, this is actually not like a strong hold but the definition on this thing is crazy if you haven't seen my wash and go um detail wash and go tutorial i believe i use this in there it just defines my curls and makes them so shiny um so divine defined and very moisturized so i do use this for braid outs but i have started pairing it um with a gel for wash and goes uh i put this on another style recently it's just very versatile but you have to um definitely make sure you wet your hair because it is very slimy and very sticky and it does best when it's going on to soaking wet hair so that's why i really like it um for like braid out from wet hair and for wash and goes the smell is amazing it smells like like summertime on the beach like a drink i don't know it smells so good it's for curly wavy kinky hair it's got no sulfates mineral oil petroleum anything it's just an all-around 
favorite of mine, which is why I in this video. So the next two products are fairly new. Those products I think I was all using last year, but we got some newbies in the building today. So the first one is actually what's in my hair right now, y'all, and it's not a gel. It's not a gel. It's a cream styler. So this is the Afro Sheen Slick Back Cream Styler. This thing right here, I oh my goodness, I love it. First of all, it's thick. It's so thick. And a little bit of it goes a long way. And you, it's not a gel, y'all. But if you want to slick back like ponytail or bun, I even did my edges with this. Like, I don't have any edge control on my hair. Um, I love this stuff. It isn't hard. It doesn't get, like, crunchy. It's just smooth and it holds and I love it <laughs> so this has been I actually when I do buns or slick back ponytails now I do not use gel this is literally what I've been going to um it smells kind of like I don't know I get like cologne from it a little bit of cologne with a hint of like something else but if you have not tried this you have to try this if you have not tried this you have to try this especially because i feel like when i do something like this um with a gel that's it like i have committed this is crunchy this is hard all the way through but this gives you the slick look you see it but no crunch it's just amazing i can't wait to try this in a whole bunch of other ways um, I'm, it does have extra hold. It is still an extra hold, but it doesn't give you a crunchy extra hold. It's soft. Um, you gotta try it. I'm done. That's it. And then the last one is, um, the Curlsmith in shower style fixer. This is another extreme hold. I told y'all if you want something other than extreme hold, this is the wrong video. Um, this is... Fairly expensive, Curl Smith, but it's worth it. I had to figure out how to use this product as well. I have said that about a couple other things, but once I figured it out, it was more than worth it. So if you have not seen my um, one product wash and go, I'll have that video linked above. But it's summertime, and if you literally wanna wash and go, like as close to wash and go as you can, this is your guide. It needs nothing else. Like, I know some people have used it with, if you guys have seen my creams and conditioners video, um, I'll have that linked if you haven't, but go check that out. There is an oil and cream that I like from Curl Smith, and I've seen people pair it, not for me, and if you've seen that video, then you know why that oil and cream is just a lot, but this on soaking wet hair with a tangle teaser, done that's all i need in the shower let it air dry and go it's so good now i do not love the smell of this product um it's i don't know it, they all kind of smell like this but it wasn't overpowering so i didn't like hate that part of it it's so quick so easy um it does get your hair good and crunchy a uh, good hold um and i would recommend using a really good either deep conditioner or um rinse out conditioner with this because i don't do anything else in my hair so i would recommend that but it is amazing and you should definitely give it a try all right y'all so those are it those are my favorite stylers and gels that i've been using recently um if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you have any questions or comments if you tried some of these products or are looking to try them let me know in the comment section if you're not subscribed to my channel please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and i will see y'all in my next video. Bye.